Welcome to the Mind Spark, bringing you the latest news from around the world. Imagine a lone traveler, Voyager 1. It's journeyed for nearly half a century, leaving behind everything it has ever known. Voyager 1 is humanity's farthest emissary, a testament to our curiosity and ingenuity. For decades, it has been our eyes and ears in the vast, silent darkness of deep space. This small machine is a piece of us flung into the great cosmic ocean. Its journey is more than a scientific mission, it is our story. It began with a simple question, what is out there? Voyager 1 represents the best of us, carrying the hopes and dreams of a species that dared to explore. Its voyage connects every person on Earth, a shared adventure that transcends borders and generations. The signal from Voyager takes nearly a full day to reach us, a reminder of the immense scale of the cosmos. Everything we have ever known has existed on that tiny speck of dust Voyager looked back upon. Its journey forces us to confront our own significance, or perhaps our insignificance. The data it sent back in its last moments has challenged our understanding of the universe and our place in it. The cosmos, it seems, had one last secret to share through its most tenacious messenger. The story of Voyager begins in the 1960s, a time of bold ambition. Astronomers realized a rare alignment of the outer planets would occur in the late 1970s, allowing a single spacecraft to slingshot from one to the next. NASA seized the opportunity, launching the Voyager program. Two identical spacecraft, Voyager 1 and 2, were built for this epic journey. Voyager 1's primary mission, study Jupiter and Saturn in unprecedented detail. It revealed Jupiter's storms, faint rings and active volcanoes on Io, profound revelations that shattered old models. At Saturn, it gave us breathtaking views of the rings and studied Titan's thick, hazy atmosphere. Having completed its primary objectives, Voyager 1's trajectory flung it out of the plane of the planets toward interstellar space. Its grand tour was over, but its greatest journey was just beginning. Aboard each Voyager is a message, the golden record. Led by Carl Sagan, a committee created a portrait of Earth for any future finders. The idea, if an intelligent civilization found Voyager, this record would be our introduction. The record is a 12-inch gold-plated copper disc containing sounds and images to portray the diversity of life on Earth. There are 115 images, greetings in 55 languages and the sounds of our planet. From a baby's cry to a whale's song, musical selections span cultures and eras from Bach to Chuck Berry. The hope was to convey our emotional and intellectual depth. The record is protected by an aluminum cover etched with diagrams explaining its origin and how to play it. There's a map showing our sun's location relative to pulsars, a cosmic clock for any finder. It is a message of peace, a gesture of outreach to the cosmos. While Voyager's instruments will fall silent, the golden record will continue its journey for a billion years or more. It is our silent ambassador carrying the story of humanity into the stars. After Jupiter and Saturn, Voyager 1 embarked on the Voyager interstellar mission, its new destination, the heliopause, where the sun's influence ends and interstellar space begins. For years, Voyager 1 flew toward this invisible wall, sending back data about its environment. Scientists watched as the solar wind slowed and cosmic rays increased, signs it was nearing the edge. In 2012, at about 11 billion miles from the sun, Voyager 1 detected a dramatic change. Solar particles dropped, cosmic rays surged, and the magnetic field shifted. After months of analysis, the team announced Voyager 1 had entered interstellar space for the first time. A human-made object was traveling through the medium between the stars. Everything Voyager 1 measured from this point forward would be a first. It was now sampling the pristine material of the galaxy, the stuff from which stars and planets are born. The data provided ground truth for decades of theories. The little spacecraft that could, designed to last just five years, had become our first interstellar scout. We had finally crossed our cosmic shoreline. For more than a decade after entering interstellar space, Voyager 1 performed flawlessly. Then, in late 2023, something went wrong. The spacecraft's communications became garbled. The Flight Data System, or FDS, began sending a repeating pattern of gibberish. Engineers at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory faced a daunting challenge, troubleshooting a 50-year-old computer from over 15 billion miles away. Every command took 22 hours to reach Voyager, and another 22 for a response. Diagnosing the problem was painstakingly slow. 
After months, they traced the issue to a failed memory chip in the FDS. The corrupted memory prevented data from being packaged correctly. The team devised a clever workaround, slicing up the affected code and storing it in different locations, bypassing the broken section. In April 2025, they sent the command to implement the patch. After a 45-hour wait, the signal came back, clear. Voyager 1 was speaking coherently again, sending back engineering data. The team had performed the most remote computer repair in human history. Voyager's voice had returned from the brink. With communications restored, the Voyager team eagerly awaited the science data. The spacecraft's instruments had continued collecting information during the blackout. In May 2025, the first batch of stored data streamed back to Earth. The readings revealed a sudden dramatic increase in plasma density around Voyager 1, a cosmic fog bank. The interstellar magnetic field surged, as if the calm ocean had turned into a storm. These were powerful, abrupt changes, unlike anything Voyager had encountered before. The cosmic ray detector showed not just more particles, but changing energy signatures, as if compressed by an unseen force. The heliopause, our solar system shield, was being squeezed by a powerful, unknown structure. The plasma wave instrument recorded a persistent, low-frequency hum, the interstellar hum. Voyager's final transmission painted a picture of a violent, active and potentially hazardous frontier. To understand these findings, we turn to Dr. Ilara Vance, an astrophysicist specializing in the interstellar medium. For decades, our models saw the interstellar medium as uniform and placid. Voyager 1 has upended that view. It's like sending a submarine into a stormy sea. The plasma density jump suggests there are structures, clouds, filaments, or shockwaves we never knew existed. We've just received our first interstellar weather report and it's calling for a storm. As our solar system moves through the galaxy, it will encounter different environments, some benign, others energetic and disruptive. The continuous interstellar hum is especially puzzling. It hints at a constant, powerful energy source. Is it a shockwave from a supernova, an interaction with dark matter? We don't know. Voyager has given us a profound mystery, likely requiring new physics to solve. The heliosphere is our shield, protecting us from harsh galactic rays. The new data suggests this shield can be compressed and weakened by external pressures. If our solar system is entering a denser region, our natural protection could be reduced. This isn't cause for immediate panic, but it's critical for understanding our long-term safety. Voyager has delivered a vital status report on our home's outer defenses. Voyager's alarming data forces us to reconsider our place in the galaxy. Our solar system is not a stable island, but a ship sailing through a dynamic, sometimes stormy, cosmic sea. The compression of the heliosphere is a stark reminder that we are intimately connected to the galaxy. Astronomers will be working for years to understand these findings. The existence of dense, energetic structures in the interstellar medium will require a complete overhaul of our galactic models. Voyager 1 has opened a new field interstellar climatology. The heliosphere's role as a cosmic ray shield is critical for life on Earth. A significant increase in galactic cosmic rays could affect astronauts, satellites and even Earth's climate. Voyager's discoveries are a powerful argument for future interstellar missions. Now we must build better ships to go and study these cosmic dragons. A Voyager 1's journey is a triumph of the human spirit. From the volcanic plains of Io to the turbulent frontier of interstellar space, it has been our steadfast guide. Its final transmission is not an end, but a new beginning a challenge to the next generation of explorers. The cosmos is more complex and surprising than we ever imagined. The Voyager mission is our curiosity made manifest, a piece of our world sent to touch the universe. The knowledge it has sent back has expanded our perspective and reminded us of the grandeur of the cosmic stage. The alarming truth from the edge of our solar system is a gift, a reminder that our journey of discovery has only just begun. The interstellar hum is a cosmic puzzle waiting to be solved. It beckons us forward, urging us to build new tools and ask bolder questions. The greatest discoveries challenge us to rethink everything. Voyager's legacy is immortal, showing us our home, our neighbors, and the vast ocean beyond. The journey never ends. As long as we look up and dare, our voyage into the cosmos will go on.